Right behind you, Sam. Low combat profile. Here they come! Now we've got their attention. Watch the lightning! Get into that building! We don't hear. This went south in a hurry! Center. Keep him off my back! You heard him! We made it! In one piece! We're there! Shuttle, we can do it again! 
A lot of people still counting on us. I'm just getting warmed up. They mean business. Keep them off your deck. Analyzing possible implants. 25% encrypted. Hurry, we don't have long. Hold them outside. Can't let them slip through. What is this place anyway? I don't know, but they sure want it back. Well, 50% encrypted. It painted syntax. I can see that. Try a recursive search. I will need a moment to evaluate the pattern. We only have a moment. Do it! <laughs> I think I really pissed that one off. Maybe because I shot him in the face. Sir, any progress? Decryption is 75% complete. We've almost got it. Could be regrouping for another push. Stay sharp. Decryption complete. That did it. It's a security override. I'll try to open the door from here. Ah, damn, it's jammed. I need to take a look at it. Ryder, I need your help over here. Go, it's okay. We'll keep a lookout. We need... Put your back into it. You really think we can shut this thing down? I don't know yet. Sam's decoded part of the language. Now we'll see if I can have a conversation. Nothing on this planet has listened so far. Just... Be careful. Worried about your old man, huh? I won't tell anyone. Come on. These are the moments that make it all worthwhile. Sam, begin translating. A moment. Indexing. Translation complete. Let's see what we have. Sunsets. Let's get back to the shuttle and Move! He's going into cardiac. 
Ryder's implant is overloading. I suggest a hardwire connection. Do it! There! Welcome back. What happened? You were clinically dead for 22 seconds. Uh, ah. Did the rest of the team make it? Hey, you're still with us. Guys, get to Sam Node. Riders awake. Who are you talking to? Sam. I didn't hear him. You're up. Look here. And here. My father. Where? It was your life or his. And he chose you. I'm so sorry. I know this must be a blow. He made the ultimate sacrifice. He got the team out of danger. We all owe him for that. He once said that when his time came, he wanted to go out among stars no one had seen before. What are we doing in Sam, Node? Sam is now part of you. In a way we don't entirely understand. It played havoc with your brain. Sam? Your father authorized the transfer of Pathfinder authority to you. Shouldn't that be Korra? In theory. In reality, you're the new Pathfinder. If that's how it has to be. Don't sell yourself short. I think you can do it. Cora? It's what he wanted. I won't stand in the way. But being Pathfinder is a serious job. You sure you're ready for this? I'm sure there's a lot I don't know, but... I'll figure it out. If it helps, you've got me to lean on. It's all academic anyway. Sam's linked to your mind on a deeper level now. Trying to untangle it could kill you. I know this is tough, but we need to start thinking about the next step. A lot of people are counting on us. Is the Ark still drifting? That's the thing. Whatever your dad did with that tower, it saved the day. Some sort of atmosphere scrubber. The energy cloud thinned out. We're on our way to the rally point now. Should be at the Nexus soon. He needs to rest first. He's got two hours. We'll need our Pathfinder for this. Oh, I checked on your sister. There's still no change. But if you can pull through, so can she. A bit of your dad in both of you. Your father will be missed. What's going on, Sam? This is our private channel. I shared it with him. Why did he do it? Why me? Unknown. But he never acted without reason. Alec wouldn't want us to lose sight of the goal. He said pain emboldens our resolve. He'd insist we grow stronger from his passing.
Ryder. Good to see you on your feet. We're at the Nexus. It's the forward hub for the entire Andromeda Initiative. The Asari, Solarian, and Turian Arcs should be there, too. Let's hope they've had better luck. Starting our approach now. It's almost as big as the Citadel back home. Nexus Control, this is Arc Hyperion, requesting docking clearance. Captain, I'm only getting their automated approach channel. Not a live person. Well, like it or not, we're here. Take us in. Construction should have been finished by now. Could be worse. How? Habitat 7's a bust. We might have started a war with the first aliens we met, and our Pathfinder's dead. This better be rock bottom. Green across the board. Docking initiated. All right. I got us here. Good luck, Pathfinder. Gonna be okay, Ryder. The captain just called me Pathfinder. This is really happening. Just take a deep breath. I still can't believe Dad's dead. This should have been his moment. But now it's yours. You just need to decide what you're gonna do with it. Where do I start? I'm just not sure I'm ready. We weren't ready to fall out of the sky on Habitat 7. But we survived that. I just updated right. the charts. So, she always keep a jump jet handy. First. Start with non-essential personnel. Okay, folks. This is what we've been waiting for. Medbay, please advise the status. It'll be nice to see some friendly faces this time. The Nexus runs a support crew, just enough to finish building the station and provide safe harbor for the Arcs. Means we can start waking our people up. They built a bar, right? Gotta have champagne for the welcome party. You're expecting one? After what we've been through, I could use a buzz. We all could. Yeah. Rough ride so far. We'll bounce back. Real food and a shower are just ahead. We weren't ready to fall out of the sky on Habitat 7, but we survived that. Right. So, always keep the jump jet handy. Okay, folks. All stasis personnel report to duty station. It'll be nice to see some friendly faces this time. The Nexus runs a support crew. Just enough to finish building the station and provide safe harbor for the Arcs. Means we can start waking our people up. They built a bar, right? Gotta have champagne for the welcome party. You're expecting one? After what we've been through, I could use a buzz. We all could. Yeah. Rough ride so far. We'll bounce back. Real food and a shower are just ahead. Here we are. Uh, I don't see any champagne. Where is everybody? Well, this can't be right. It's like everything's on standby. If it's a surprise party. Welcome to the Nexus, gateway to Andromeda. I'm Avina, a virtual intelligence designed to assist you with immigration. Uh, can you tell us where the welcome party is hiding? I'm sorry, 
My code is limited to information and simple interaction simulations. Please select from the following pre-programmed responses. How does the immigration process work? We ask that you submit to a brief medical exam to ensure your health and well-being after making such a long journey. Once you've been cleared, our colonization experts will assist you in finding your new home. Please be mindful of the queue. Thousands of eager colonists like you are waiting to begin their new life in Andromeda. Uh, where? You tell me about the Andromeda Galaxy. Here in Andromeda, you are over two million light years away from the Milky Way Galaxy. This is the furthest any life form has ever traveled outside our home system, making you a brave pioneer indeed. The Nexus itself is located in a region known as the Helios Cluster. Here, you and thousands of your fellow colonists will fulfill your dreams of settling a new home. Fortune awaits. What year is it? The current year is 2819. After spending over 600 years in stasis, it's normal to feel disoriented or confused upon arrival. Our helpful medical staff can assist with any physical or psychological after effects you may be experiencing. Well, she's got the date right, at least. So where is everyone? What is the Nexus? The Nexus serves as the central hub for the Andromeda Initiative's colonization efforts. It is the first destination for all colonists upon their arrival in the new galaxy. Please enjoy the many venues the Nexus has to offer. As the station expands, it will one day serve as the seat of government for Milky Way colonists. Providing a safe, stable, and prosperous environment is our primary goal. Not from the looks of it. Where do colonists live? Once you've cleared immigration, our helpful staff will assist you in choosing the home world of your dreams. The rolling hills of Habitat 3, or perhaps the mysterious twilight world of Habitat 5. Whichever you choose, rest assured our Pathfinders have carefully vetted all colony worlds to ensure your security and prosperity. Oh boy. Habitat 7? That's where we landed. She's way out of date. That's all. It has been my pleasure. Please see one of our helpful immigration staff for further assistance. And welcome to your new home in Andromeda, where the brightest star is you. Current wait time for immigration processing is... Unknown error. Right. That was helpful. Plants are still alive. It's like they didn't finish building it. Hello? There's a guy. Maybe he's got champagne. Hi there. We're from Arc Hyperion, and... Wondering where everybody went. Did he hear you? Did you say an arc? Yeah, we just got in. And for what it's worth, your VI over there could use an update. But... We thought you were all dead. What? Or captured, or lost in dark space, or... But you're here! You have no idea how much this means. I don't believe it. I'm Tyrion Kandros. I lead our militia on the Nexus. Peter, this is Cora Harper and Liam Costa, part of the Pathfinder team. I'm sorry for the confusion. Our sensors told us an arc had arrived, but Helios is notorious for scrambling equipment. We thought you were just another malfunction. Well, I've got a shipload of people that says we're here. Of course, it's just... you're the first arc we've seen. After a year of waiting and no sign of the others, we shuttered this area and stopped looking. You've been stranded for a whole year? Longer. I'll fill you in on the way to Op Center. Go wrong with our plan has. We arrived 14 months ago. Right away, we hit a band of dark energy that knocked us off course. 
We're familiar with it. Then you'll know why we call it the Scourge. We lost whole sections of the station. A lot of people died. No power, no food. The chaos went on for months. It finally led to armed rebellion. When order was restored, the insurgents were banished. Exiles, we call them. Are things back to normal? Not even close. But you're here now, so maybe the worst is over. No word from the other Pathfinders? No word from anyone, period. Any threats from the locals? So far, we've stayed hidden. We're here. You guys go ahead. I'll check out the security situation. You should know our command structure has been fractured. Some of us are filling in for leaders who died. Is it true? They said drop everything and report for duty. And no one was expecting an ARC to finally show up. Docking procedures are green across the board. Stand by to merge Hyperion power into the grid. The crew of the Hyperion. Good luck. I'm Jaren Tan, director of the initiative. You have no idea how much your arrival means to us. Not as much as it means to us. We had one help. Hungry faces. Any supplies you can spare would be appreciated. This is Foster Addison. She oversees colonial affairs. Where's the Pathfinder? You're looking at him. You're not Alec Ryder. My father's dead. He made me his successor. Alec... is dead. Please understand. The entire initiative is at risk. None of the Golden Worlds panned out. They're a bust. And there's been no word from the other Arcs. What happened to them? Unknown. Our supplies are nearly depleted. Rationing bought us some time, but even that's running out. We need to find more resources. But that takes people. And we can't wake them up. Until they have somewhere to live. A golden world. Now more than ever, we need a Pathfinder. It now falls to you, Ryder. Are you up to the task? I may not have been the first choice. But I'm ready for this. Youthful enthusiasm will only get you so far in Andromeda. That's no way to treat a guest. I'm Nak Morkesh, superintendent of this station. I hope they haven't scared you off already. It's nothing personal, but now isn't the time for on-the-job training. At least the Pathfinder here seems willing to try. We could use a fresh perspective. You've heard my concerns. I'll leave you to it. We're all feeling the pressure. Let's have a private word in my office, Ryder. We'll discuss giving you a scout ship. I'm happy to work out the details with your associate. Welcome to the Nexus. I can't believe how far off track things have gone. It's bad, but it's not over. Not yet. Ma'am, the Hyperion's core is now online. Let me show you something. An hour ago, that was all dark. But with the power from your ship, you're keeping the lights on. You have my vote. You'd best go talk to Director Tan. Make sure that doesn't happen. And don't be shy. Come see me when you have a chance.
This is the planet where we landed. Habitat 7. It wasn't even close to livable. That's been true of every world we've found. Ryder, we were discussing your next expedition. Good. I was starting to wonder who was in charge around here. Director Addison is entitled to her opinion, and mine overrules hers. Does she know that? I oversee the entire initiative, and I have decided to give you a chance to prove yourself. To that end, the scourge dealt us a serious blow. Whatever it is, our scientists theorize it's not natural. An artificial energy cloud? It wasn't here when we left the Milky Way, yet it rendered all the Golden Worlds unlivable. Then there's the aliens you ran into, the Ket. They're obsessed with alien structures we found scattered around the cluster. They'll do anything to prevent other that isn't exclusive to the Milky Way. And now the challenge is to settle a world in spite of all that. This one here, Eos. Oh. You need to increase the viability of the planet so we can establish an outpost. Then we can bring more colonists out of stasis. The more colonists we have, the more resources we can gather to support the Nexus. Everything depends on it. There are six worlds we hope to settle. Okay. But you said every planet you found is unlivable. So, how do I... A good Pathfinder would relish the challenge of solving it. Right. I think I should go check on things. And if I fail, I guess it's no sweat off your back, right? You'll just look for another Pathfinder? Placing bets on people is part of my job. Some of them pay off. Others... The way I see it, you need me. If I pull this off, maybe you'll look like the leader you pretend to be. But first, you have to succeed at being the Pathfinder you pretend to be. Where's my ship? They're prepping it now in the docking bay. The coordinates for EOS will be in the computer. And when you have a moment, we should discuss the missing arcs. I was wondering about that. Ah. Something wrong? Ryder, can you see me and Sam on the Hyperion? Your implant needs attention, and we need to discuss a confidential matter. No, I'm fine. We are working on accessing more power from the Hyperion. Looks fine so far. All non ah, ah. requests are currently on hold until power coupling is complete. Hey, you okay? I'm fine. My arms got the brunt of it. Stuff exploding like this happen often? Back right after the mutiny, we had a lot of this happening. But not lately. I wasn't there during the mutiny. Lucky. I thought we were done with this, honestly. That maybe I was just being paranoid. What is there to be paranoid about? We've had three malfunctions in the past week. That's not good. Sorry, understatement. Yeah. And now I have more repairs. Whoever's doing this has to be stopped before someone gets seriously hurt. That's what I'm trying to do. But I'm an engineer, not a PI. I've scanned all the potential sabotage areas I can think of. But I don't know who to trust anymore. Sounds like a lot went down before the Hyperion docked. Yeah, I guess. Wait! That's it! You can't possibly be involved in this. You weren't even here during the mutiny. Would you, if, if you have time? Maybe you could help me. If they start hitting critical systems. Sure thing. What can I do? If you could scan these other panels while I fix this one. That'd really help. I've sent the locations to your Omni tool. Just send me the data when you're done. No, and I don't, I don't know. It, it just blew up. Find out why. Be careful. Hello, I'm Gian Garson, founder of the Initiative. It's through your hard work that the vision of the Nexus has come to life. You and all your colleagues bind our proud new colonies together. Look around at your achievements. And if you have any questions, my door is always open. Founder Garson's office is located at Workspace Not Allocated. Please select a topic. Mellow, you already checked the count.
consoles down here, right? Huh. I think you forgot to hit confirm when you filled out the forms. They're not this. Hey there. You okay? Those guys really grilled you. <laughs> and Addison. First Pathfinder they've seen in over a year. All she can do is question your competence? Which one was Addison again? All politicians look the same to me. <laughs> same here. Next time we'll ask for a seating chart. I worked out logistics with Director Tan. They're giving us a ship and crew. He said their best is taking care of it. I still need to head back to the Ark and check in with Sam. Sounds good. While you're there, maybe see how your sister's doing. to Andromeda, Nigel. Thank you. It's bittersweet, though. My little brother Dash was stationed on the Nexus. I just learned he died on Eos, trying to start a settlement. That's awful. I'm sorry, Nigel. Yeah. We were gonna start families out here together. <sighs> I have a pendant our father Ash had its match. Will you... reunite them? Of course. In his digital journal, he mentioned a spot on Eos where he'd go to think. If you could leave the pendant there. Leg's feeling a little better. Looks like the muscle's bruised. The good news is the bone didn't break. I'm sure the bastards are getting out. Ryder, good to see you. Damn shame about your dad, though. I'm sorry we couldn't save him. I'm sure you did everything you could. Yeah, but still, we lost a Pathfinder on my watch. Doesn't sit right. My dad knew the danger. Part of the job. Now I just need to make sure your sister here pulls through. How's Sarah doing? Her condition's stable. I see signs of REM activity in the brain, so she's dreaming. Means all the wiring still works. How'd this happen? It was dumb luck, really. We hit the scourge at the worst possible moment, just as the stasis revival was kicking in. It's a vulnerable moment, coming out of a 600-year nap, then wham! Circuits fried and overloaded the neural pathways. Don't worry, I'm on it. We're not losing another rider. Are you staying here on the Hyperion? You know that moment when you realize you're just getting too old? Uh... Ha, <laughs> right, look me, it happens. For me, it was Habitat 7. Watching you guys running around, dodging lightning and the cat, it's a young man's game. Pains me to admit it, but it's passed me by. We'll miss you, Harry. Just make sure to raise some hell once in a while, will you? I'm living vicariously through you. <laughs> Deal. That's all, Harry. Thanks. Don't be a stranger. If anything changes with Sarah, I'll let you know. Just if my connection to your implant, the headache you experienced before shouldn't reoccur. 
Yeah, what was that about? You said we need to discuss something confidential. You should know certain facts before you leave on your expedition. It seemed best we speak alone. Sam, if we're going to work together, you can't keep hiding things from me. Apologies. I am simply following your father's wishes. What was he keeping secret? My true capabilities. Alec overrode the implant safety protocols. It allows me unrestricted access to the Pathfinder's physiology. And that's... me, now. And only you. I can act as a force multiplier, dramatically enhancing your motor and neural skills when required. Alec called them profiles. They provide unique, tactical augmentation during combat. Your father preferred to keep this fact to himself. Keeping things like this secret just makes everyone suspicious. Like you're up to something. Alec didn't think others would understand. He viewed it as a symbiotic relationship, benefiting us both. Sign, I am fully sentient. Far beyond what even the initiative understands. I don't follow. You're an AI. So what's different? I am a new form of AI, drawing directly from the human experience. Your implant is my window into the world. That's... Pretty amazing. But beyond what many people will accept, your father knew some would fear it. Yeah, he's got a point. So what does this mean for the two of us? I find myself in an unusual position. Though I had access to your father's experiences, there is a gap in my understanding. How so? He placed a block on portions of my memory array. Why? Perhaps so when you asked me what his plan was, I wouldn't know. <sighs> and Dad strikes again. But not without recourse. The further you explore as a Pathfinder, the more blocks will be removed. Perhaps you should begin in your father's quarters. In the meantime, unless you have more questions, your new ship awaits. Thanks. Ready to see what Tan gave us? I hear it's something special. Pathfinder en route. How's the ship? In final checks, looking great. We won't be long. The way things are going, we'll be on our own out there. In other words, we're making this up as we go. <laughs> we used to call that tactical improvisation. But at least we'll be doing it in style. They call her the Tempest. Let's go take a closer look. Let's pick it up a bit, people. We're 14 months late. So you're the one who's making everything happen. Vetra. Vetra Nix. Initiative Wrangler, Provisioner, Gunner, and everything in between. Are we ready? The sooner we get out of here, the better. You're coming with us? Yes. Otherwise, there's no way they're letting this ship off the station. Yeah. Let's go see the rest of Helios. Hold it, hold it! You're not going anywhere. Damn it. Whatever happened, it wasn't me. I just got here. Director Addison wants to see a complete report of the Tempest's supplies, munitions, and crew. Director Tan overruled Addison. 
The ships loaded out with equipment for outpost discovery, squarely under Director Addison's purview. Seen you around. Ben, right? Came here with a family, didn't you? Son still in cryo? I could pull some str- Really? Yeah, really. They told me he wasn't essential, but I miss him. I know. I got family too, Ben. It's done. <sighs> Addison's gonna kill me. Nicely done. Part of the job, Pathfinder. All things considered, it was an easy ask. And right now, you need people tearing down obstacles, not putting up more. Finally, someone who cares about doing stuff and not just talking about it. Everything state-of-the-art. Labs, sensors, exploration gear. Lesser crew, of course. The best in their field. Ah, glad to see you looking well. The engine core is based on the Ark's Odyssey drive. It runs a hell of a lot quieter. That's Gil Brody. Engineer, my wrench jockey. We call this the research room. There's space for upgrading equipment, gathering intel. Router engaged. Securing connection to Tempest. Welcome aboard, Sam. And Ryder, of course. All run by Suvi Anwar, our science officer. Your quarters are below. Plenty of space up here to get everyone together. It's all yours. <sighs> it's really gonna be something, isn't it? I haven't even shown you the best part. When you're ready to fly, head over to the bridge. Our pilot should have everything good to go. We call this the research room. You can run research projects and coordinate with the Nexus from here. here. Seems like we're forever racing, but there's always time to check out new toys. Useful ones. Always game for new toys. This makes use of old ones, like anything you grabbed on Habitat 7. Raw minerals, tech, doesn't matter. The research station will strip that stuff down, give you options. Own for everybody else. That's what Pathfinder means now. Yeah, well, everybody should be so lucky. This tech is aces. If the best we get is what we make, still the best. Check it out. Departure trajectory locked, Nexus Control. Ah, time for introductions. You must be Ryder, Gallo Jath. A pleasure to be here, and to meet you, of course. I'll be pilot. It'll take a Pathfinder's guidance to see us through Helios. I'm new to this. Being a Pathfinder running a ship? You'll be fine. As for the ship, I can help. I knew the Tempest when she was a blueprint. I was test pilot for the Tempest's early prototypes. I admit, I'm itching to see how she performs out here. So how do I... The console syncs with your implant. Just swipe, 
Touch a destination here, and the nav system calculates everything. Very efficient. It was optimized for a Pathfinder. Everything's secure, if you're ready. Is anyone ready for something this big? We signed on for the big stuff when we came to Andromeda. All right. Excuse me. Excuse me. Command access is transferring successfully. Eh, uh, science and monitoring stations look fine. Lexi's reporting in. Helm is green. Gil reports the drive core is online. This is it, Ryder. The Tempest is yours. Unless you've got something to say for the log. I never planned to be Pathfinder. I don't know what's out there. But we're the Milky Way's best and brightest. We can do this. Nexus Control, this is the Tempest. Ident 2527, prepping to depart. Departure vector verified, Tempest. Godspeed, Pathfinder. To Eos, then. What would have been our Habitat 1? Two failed outposts put an end to the idea. Maybe we can turn things around. Callow, take us in. about as far as the Nexus surveyors could get before, well... Let's see what's waiting here. Suiting up. Ready, Freddy. Hope we're all that ready. Callow. All right? Integrating search area from Sam. How he pulled that mystery signal through the storms, I have no idea. Multisensory neural collation. Amazing. Factory fresh across the board, spinning up the compensators. You're already tuning the displays. We'll get a better read on this pass than the Nexus has had in months. What? I said a lot of people have their hopes pinned on us. They gave up on Eos. I can't blame them. Expected a golden world, instead they saw their friends die. Never know how that'll affect. Oh, sorry. You okay? This is exactly why we came. A new galaxy? A new ship? I can't wait to get both a little dirty. Pathfinder, the Tempest checks out. We're good. Take us down. You have no idea how long I've wanted a Pathfinder to say that. Core is hot. Shields holding, adjusting entry. We got this, right? Set us down at this nav point. 